Nata, I love your Halloween costume. Mm. You are dressed up as a baby shark. Mm -hmm. Whoa. And as you can see, I am dressed up as a firefighter. Right now, Meta and I are going to make our very own paper plate pumpkin. Would you like to join us? Yes? Mm -hmm. Okay, first we're going to paint our paper plate with orange paint. Wait, where's my paintbrush? Meta, do you see my paintbrush? Do you hear that? Oh, look! It's Meta's favorite superhero stuffy, Mimi the Orange Fox. Ah, oh, Mimi! You are dressed up as a butterfly for Halloween. Mm -hmm. I love your butterfly costume, Mimi. Oh, and I see you brought your paintbrush for us to use. Thank you for sharing your paintbrush with us, Mimi. That was very kind of you. Okay, I will set Mimi over here on top of this orange pumpkin. Okay, now I like to flip the plate over and paint this side of the plate so that our pumpkin feels a tad more round. Okay, mm -hmm. let's paint our plate orange. Okay, now, while we let the paper plate dry, we will use these pieces of black and brown construction paper to cut out two triangle eyes, one triangle nose, a mouth for our pumpkin, mm -hmm. and a stem. Now, depending on how old you are, you may need a grown-up to do this part for you, and that's okay. All right, first, I will cut out two triangle eyes and one triangle nose like this. Okay, now let's cut out the mouth. Nate, mm -hmm. you can get really creative here. You can make a happy mouth, or a spooky mouth, or even a silly mouth. Whatever shape you wanna cut out will work. Did you know that there are no mistakes in art? Mm. There's no wrong in art. You can do whatever you want to do, especially when you are being creative. Mm. Okay, let's cut out the mouth like this. All right, and finally, I will use this brown construction paper to cut out a stem for the pumpkin. Mm. Okay, the orange paint is now dry. Let's glue our construction paper pieces onto our pumpkin. Wait, Meta, do you see where I put my glue stick? Mm. Oh no, I don't think I brought my glue stick. <gasps> What's that, Meta? Mm. Mr. Butterfly? Mm. Oh, look, it's Mr. Butterfly. And he is dressed up as a spider for Halloween. I also see, Mr. Butterfly, that you brought some glue. That was very kind of you, Mr. Butterfly, to share your glue with us. Okay, let's glue the construction paper pieces onto the pumpkin like this. Mm. 
Whoa, Meta, look at that, whoa. Okay, the last thing I want to do is add a green vine to the top of the pumpkin using a green pipe cleaner. Hmm. Wait a minute, I don't see the green pipe cleaner anywhere. <gasps> I must have forgotten to bring the green pipe cleaner as well. Oh no. <gasps> Look who it is. It's Meta's little sister, Gigi. Mm. Oh, Gigi is dressed up as a bumblebee for Halloween. <gasps> I see that Gigi brought us a green pipe cleaner. Yay. Thank you, Gigi, for bringing us this pipe cleaner. That is very kind of you. Okay, I'm going to use this hole puncher to punch a hole at the top of my pumpkin like this. Ooh. Okay. Then I'm going to slide the green pipe cleaner through the hole and twist one time, like this. Wah! All right, now I will make our vine curly by wrapping it around my finger, like this. Wow, look at that. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's do the exact same thing, but on the other end. Whoa. Whoa! <laughs> we did it! We made our very own paper plate pumpkin. <laughs> Thank you, Mimi and Gigi and Mr. Butterfly for helping Meta and I make this Halloween pumpkin. Now, you can hang your pumpkin on your refrigerator or on a wall or even in a window of your home as a Halloween Decoration. Meta is now going to go visit our friend Miss Y at mm -hmm. the Curiosity Lab in the city to make some Halloween oobleck. Hello everyone, Meta. Mm. I love your shark costume. Mm -hmm. Oh, and Bolty the robot. You are looking great as well. I love your snazzy green hair. For Halloween, I am dressed up as a Silly scientist! Since I'm already a scientist, I thought that it would be really fun to make myself look super silly. <laughs> and as you can see, for Halloween, I decorated my laboratory with all these fun decorations. Isn't it great? <laughs> okay, I'm so excited to make some orange oobleck for Halloween. Oobleck is kind of like slime, but different. Like slime, oobleck is a non-Newtonian fluid, which means oobleck is neither a liquid or a solid. Mm. You can hold oobleck in your hand and make a hard ball, but within a few seconds, it will then turn back into liquid and fall right back into the bowl. Mm. Let's get started. First, add four cups of cornstarch to a large bowl. in there. Ooh, that's fun. Then you want to add two cups of water. We already added a bunch of orange food coloring dye to our water so that our oobleck once mixed will be a nice Halloween-y orange color. Grown-ups, if you're doing this experiment at home, you may want to cut our measurements in half. Let's add the orange water now. Ooh, Meta. <gasps> I can see it reacting already. Mm. Now, you have to mix the cornstarch and the water really well. to tell you, you may need to add some more cornstarch if the mixture is too soupy, 
or you may have to add some more water if the mixture is too hard. Make sure to add only little amounts of each until you get just the right consistency. The last thing we're going to do is add these pretend plastic purple and green spiders for Halloween. Hmm. Okay, Meta, watch this. I can pick up the oobleck and make a ball using my hand, but then watch. Did you see that? Mm -hmm. I'll do it again. It turned right back into the liquid and fell into the bowl. How neat is that? Mm -hmm. Well, Meta, I hope you have a very happy Halloween and thank you for visiting the Curiosity Lab today. And remember, Miss Y is here, so ask away. <gasps> Did you have a good time with Miss Y making Halloween oobleck? Mm -hmm. Yes. Do you know what time it is? It's time to dance. This is where we stop what we're doing, stand up, and dance. You can do whatever dance move you feel like doing. Oh, do you hear that? Mm -hmm. It's the idea train. And look, it's Pinky the Boombox. Hi, Pinky the Boombox. All right. Thank you, idea train. Mm -hmm. All right, I will put Pinky the Boombox right here. Pinky plays our music. I will take this gold cassette tape and put it in here, then close it up, and I will push the button with the triangle on it, the play button. Are you ready to dance? Mm -hmm. Yes? Okay, I will push the play button now. was a lot of fun. Okay, let's get back to what we were doing. Guess what? It's time to share some mate art. This is a map of the world. The colorful shapes on this map represent all the different places we live on our planet. The first piece of art we are going to share today was sent to us by a family who lives in the United States of America in the state of Ohio. An awesome kid named Sam made this made to art. Sam, you did a fantastic job drawing all of us. Right here, we have me, B, with an amazing smile on my face. I like how you created my flannel shirt by drawing different color rectangles. That is really neat. Next to B is Meta. Made to look at the idea light bulb on your sweater. Here is Bolty the robot and Miss Y at the Curiosity Lab. Mr. Butterfly is above Miss Y, and down here, the idea train is on some train tracks. I love the bright green trees here, and Pinky the Boombox down here. I also love that you drew each character saying hi by raising one of their hands in the air. Sam, thank you for sending us your fantastic mate art. The next piece of art we're going to share today was sent to us by a family who lives in Sweden. An amazing kid named Umair made this Meta art. Umair, nice job at drawing Meta and B. I like how you used the color purple to draw Meta's sweater and the color yellow to draw the idea light bulb on B's hat and 
on Meta's sweater. Nice job at writing the letter B and Meta's name. M-A-Y-T-A. Meta. I also see you wrote your name here. Thank you, Umair, for sending us your magnificent Meta art. And the last pieces of art we are going to share today was sent to us by a family who lives in Australia. Two really cool sisters named Annika and Layla made this Meta art. Annika and Layla, you both did a great job drawing Meta, B, Mr. Butterfly, and your big sister. Layla, I love your green grass and your green hearts. And Annika, I love the smiles you drew on all of your characters. Thank you, Annika and Layla, for sending us your fantastic Meta art. Before we go, let's say five good things about ourselves. Do you want to do that? Yes? Okay, I'll go first, and then you repeat what I say after me. Number one, I am strong. Number two, I am helpful. Number three, I am smart. Number four, I am brave. Number five, I am kind. Wow, that was really great. Nicely done. To keep learning with Meta, me, and all of our friends, make sure to hit the subscribe button below. Thank you for spending your time with us, and we hope you have a happy Halloween. Until next time, bye! Hey,